Hi, I'm firefighter paramedic Dusty Arroyo. Today we'll be going over the Draeger XM8000, which we use to measure toxins, vapors, and combustible gases. This will be a brief refresher on the basic functions and operations of the device in case you're working here at Station 24. This device is a foregas as well as a PID. The gases listed for measurement are isobutylene, methane, O2, CO, and hydrogen sulfide. Located at the bottom of the Draeger Exam 8000 are the three multifunction keys. It has a pump adapter screwed on to the top of the device. The pump located at the top is equipped with a dust and water filter and provides additional protection for sensor membranes. Attached to the bottom of the device is a shoulder strap for ease of carrying when going into an IDLH. To turn the device on, press the green OK button for 3 seconds. A self-test is run, the LEDs flash, an audible sound is emitted, and a vibration alarm is activated. Alarm thresholds and other pertinent messages will display. The alarm 1 threshold will activate when the gas concentration is more than the preset alarm limit. The Alarm 2 threshold will notify you of an IDLH environment and to leave the hazard area immediately. It cannot be silenced. Flow tests will now be performed. When the monitor instructs you to block the inlet, use your finger to obstruct flow for one second. And the device will then be in measuring mode and ready for use. Before taking measurements, go to a fresh air environment and perform a fresh air calibration. Go to the display menu by selecting the left blue button. Press the green OK button. Scroll down to maintenance and select. Select the fresh air calibration. It will now perform a flow test, block the inlet with your finger. Remove your finger once it says to unblock the inlet. You are now ready to start your fresh air calibration. Press the OK button to apply the fresh air. Once you see all the gases checked in green, press the OK button. And the device will then be in measuring mode and ready for use. Before taking a measurement, attach probe adapter and screw hose onto pump. Select the menu button, scroll down to confined space and select. The next display will show a list of hose lengths. Select telescopic probe. A flow test will initiate to ensure there are no leaks in the system. Press the OK button and next a 20 second purge countdown will take place to make sure you're getting the sample out of the confined space to the sensors in the monitor. The monitor is ready for use. Remember to take into account whether the gas or vapor being measured is heavier or lighter than air. To shut down the monitor, simultaneously press the blue arrow keys and wait for a 3 second shutdown period. This concludes the brief tutorial on the Draeger Exam 8000. Thanks for watching.